future, five, ten years from now, when you want to get a job? Because they're going to pull your background record. And guess what? All of, I was young too. I got in trouble. And guess what? I was arrested for theft. But they didn't have juvenile civil citations then, right? So fast forward, I finished college and I applied to be a police officer in Orlando Police Department. They called me in, they said, you were arrested. I said, I was a teenager and they didn't hire me. So I came to Jacksonville and I was blessed to get an opportunity to become what I always desired to be. So don't think because you're young and you do something, it's okay. Because your record will follow you. So just you gotta make, make very good decisions. But again, the civil citation is really, it gives young people another opportunity to get right. So just, uh, I think to clarify a little bit, I guess technically there's, there's three things. You can, you can be arrested, you can get a, um, a notice to appear, which some people think is a civil citation, and it's not. That's where you have to go when you set a court date. Uh, technically that is an arrest, just so you all know that. Um, and lastly, there, there's the true civil citation. When that happens, uh, I actually just started getting these recently, um, where uh, they'll have you report to the state attorney's office, you actually never even goes through the court system whatsoever. Um, it's not technically even a civil case. It's uh, it's just a diversionary citation through the state attorney's office. So they have started using those more and they are very helpful. So that's the difference.